Binoculars by Zeiss. A car by Maserati. You find it in a lighter by Dupont. A watch by Omega. And in cigarettes by John Player Special. Specially created by John Player to be the world's finest achievement in Virginia cigarettes. Some things in life have a special quality. John Player Special. Hey guys, Archie Luxury. How are you today? How are you today? Guys. I just want to say thank you for coming on. I'm trying to get the timing for this car show. Um, I got to tell you guys, the car show, how is it going? Not so well. Not so well. It's, it's tough. It is very, very tough doing car talk. Uh, it's, just, it's just hard shit. It's really hard shit. Car talk. I like talking cars, but it's it's difficult because, you know, we're not really known as a motoring channel. I've always loved cars, but I, I couldn't really afford them, you know. That was the big problem for me. I got the snake in. Mike the snake. How are you, Mike? I'm fine. Mike, I want to let you know, right? I went out yesterday. Fuck me, dead. You know, I'm trying to save this BMW for special occasions. I took my wife out to a restaurant, which was shh. It was the food was nice, but it was semi shit because it took so long to get served and that. And what they did was we had a bottle of sparkling water. It was so slow, they brought a second bottle. And I thought, oh, okay. But they charged me $7 for a second bottle. I'm thinking, the only reason I drank the water is because it's so fucking slow here, sunshine. And he recommended a salad. It was just fucking lettuce. That's not a salad. That's just lettuce. Yeah. You know what I mean or not? Yeah. Yeah. No. I mean... Have I got any right to be angry or, or how does do you not feel? Sound, that does not sound reasonable. Yeah, I I just feel angry, okay? I just feel angry today. I don't yeah. know if you ever feel angry at times. Oh, yeah. No, I have those days. Oh, shit. I have days where I'm just angry at my life situation, where I'm so at. Your life situation, you're alive. You're not dead. Yeah. No, but what I'm just saying. What are you, you complaining know, about? You got well, everything. No. You're not you're not hitched to a bitch. What the fuck, man? I'm you should be saying. over you got two dogs. What no, the fuck is your problem? I'm, I'm happy every day I wake up, but I'm just saying there's there are those days like you're saying where um yeah. I feel that way. That's all. That's all I'm I saying. You're angry man. at times, okay? Yeah. Uh wasn't making any major statement out of it. Um but you know, not every day is just all fucking unicorns and fucking yeah, be fluffy in blue clouds, you know. So, um, so number one, I'll tell you what went wrong with the restaurant. Three things. Number one, they brought out a second bottle of sparkling water and they nabbed me seven bucks for it. We should have asked, "Do you want another bottle of water, sir?" I would have said no because I piss all night. Number two, yeah, they recommended a salad. It, it wasn't a salad; it was just fucking lettuce. And number three, it, I told them it's my wife's birthday meal because her birthday's next Saturday. They sing happy birthday to every other asshole in the place, but they, 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 they didn't sing happy birthday to us. I just, it just pisses me off. Yeah. Okay. No, and that makes every bit of sense in the world, man. Um, I'm angry about it, okay? Yeah, when you go and out, I got home, you go, you go I got out home, and we got home well. late, and the wife's not in the mood. Well, what the fuck was that for? Yeah, when you go out, you, you go out to be treated 
it's you know better than what you get at home and and you pay for I, it you know i told him i just i just sent him a reply this morning i just said to him i'm not coming back again yeah do you have we over here we have a website called yelp yeah no i'm not, not going to do that to them but i'm just pissed off okay i'm really pissed off okay yeah I'm just pissed off, okay? I'm really pissed off, okay? Is that okay to say that to you or not? Is And today is your wife's birthday? No, it's next week. Oh, okay. Well, remind me and I'll sing happy birthday to your wife. I'll send him an email. Hello. Really disappointed. One. Why bring a second bottle of sparkling water without firstly asking? You charged me seven bucks for a second bottle. The only, I mean, I. I write this now. The only reason why I drank the first bottle was because your service was so slow. Number two, you recommended the salad, not a salad. That was merely lettuce. No olive oil. No capsicum. No mushroom. Capsicum. 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 So damn boring. And Did it have any expensive. dressing on it or anything? No dressing whatsoever for lousy lettuce. Number three, it was my wife's birthday dinner and nobody saying happy birthday i have endured he endure endure how do you spell endure d-u-r you endured the singing for every other person but we miss out i won't be coming back I won't be upset and let sound. You mentioned that you Please will be recommending to discuss, and I will gladly explain in detail. Also, ex uh, mentioned that uh, you will not recommend their restaurant ah, to any them. future people that okay. that's what that's what hit that'll hit home though that is what will will raise their eyebrow i used to like the, i like the food i like the food okay i do like it i've been there many times yeah i just so feel that might cheated, actually get okay? something get a risk get a response no, i don't give it i mean they might oh, come back with please thing, accept okay? our apologies for come back for a free meal and we promise the the most excellent service you've ever seen, you know. Um, I, 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 I don't think I'm being an asshole. I don't want to be an asshole, okay? I don't want to be an asshole, okay, Mike? Sure. I don't want to be a fucking asshole, okay? There's no super chats. Is there any super chats, Mike? 
Yes, there right, is. Yeah. Envy Scotsman, three dollars. Mike, sing happy birthday. Well, it, it it's next week. We'll do it next week. Okay. Thank you, Envy Scotsman. Uh, let me just tell you something, Envy uh, Mike. Now that we've set myself into a really foul fucking mood, can we talk about the new Mercedes C-Class? Sure. Yeah, that's what I'd like to talk about. Now that I've been fucking let down time and time again, let's talk about the Mercedes-Benz C-Class. So let me tell you, firstly, I went there because, you know, I was so looking forward to the new Mercedes-Benz. Okay. Okay. Mike? Yeah. I was looking forward to the new Mercedes Benz. Okay. Let's have a look inside the C class. What do I think? And we, we need we to go. drop the we need to drop the link for other people to join in. Okay. I'll get the link. Look inside. It, 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 it's Space Invaders. Look at this. It's like a fucking iPad. Look. Oh, my God. Look at that. Inside there, Mike. Two big giant. It's, yeah, you know it's what like this fucking off? space shuttle. Now, I, I tell you what I fucking hate about this car, okay? Let me tell you what I hate about it. Who's this guy? Hello? Who's this? Paul Pluter. Who's this? What do you think this is? Can? Of course. A can? You don't, you don't read the name here? Like... Sorry, I'm in, I'm in a bad mood today. I know, we're not talking oh, cars. Out. We're talking restaurants and shitty birthdays. And Where's okay. the car talk, boys? No, 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 you don't understand. No, you don't understand. I want to get into a really foul mood because I want to talk about the new Mercedes-Benz C-Class. I was telling Jen how much you were hating on Mercedes. No, no, no. I love Mercedes-Benz, okay? I love, Merce very quickly, Evan Hoggen Camp. $2. Arch, thoughts on the Honda CRV for first car purchase? Evan, the old Honda CRV was incredible. The problem is they've gone from a 2.4 liter motor, which that motor was indestructible. Uh, Scotty Kilmer has said that motor is one of the best motors. You'll get 400,000 out of it. I had it in the Accord. <clears throat> Guess what? They're now using a fucking 1.5 liter turbo. Fuck off, Honda. Fuck off, Honda. Fuck off. I think that old okay. 2.4 was what they call a non-interference motor. They used to make that, interference and non-interference motors. And um, <laughs> one, motor if the time amazing. machine broke, they nothing happened on a non-interference motor. And on an interference motor, if the belt, the timing belt broke, the, the engine was just instantly fucking totally. destroyed. Well, that's uh, in a BMW, it'll be destroyed as well with the, the timing chain. Jay yeah, Wright, they, they don't have those issues. <laughs> Hello, Jay anymore. Wright, who the fuck's this? Andy Man, Andy Man, Andy. Art, sorry, this is off topic. Hello, I just my ex. Hello, who's this? It's Jay Wright. Okay, uh, I I'm just, just um, my a person. Okay, just sit there for a minute. I just bought my Air King at retail. Should I sell now or will rock? Man, I don't fucking know. Let me get my crystal balls back. Once once my wife gives me my crystal balls back, I'll tell you. I have no <laughs> fucking idea, Andy man. Andy man, stay tuned. We will come back to you. I'll answer that question in detail. Archie Luxury live streaming. When I finish this show, we're going to the Archie Luxury live stream channel. I'm actually going to, going to, uh, I'm going to copy that question, and we will, we'll go through it. Let me just tell you this, okay? Let me just explain something to you, guys. The Mercedes Benz, it sucks. I didn't think I could fit in. Tan, do you think you could fit in here? Tell me. Yeah, I could fit in that. Look, 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 look. But look, look, Tan. The door is smaller than normal. Okay? Do you understand what I'm saying to you or not? No, I get it. It looks kind of tight. It looks kind of tight. It kind of is tight, okay? And I don't know what young turds they is think from are going to buy. Sorry? No. It's actually... Um, 
It's actually yes, rear wheel drive. It's rear wheel drive. It's rear wheel drive. I'm just going to show it to you. Okay, let's have a look at this here. I'll bring this up. I want to show you this here. Okay, let's bring it. Look at this here. This is the W207. Okay, this is the look at the W20. Those wheels are fucking ugly. Do you tan? You're you're a man of style. Are those wheels ugly? Tell me. Yeah, I'm not too big of a fan of those wheels, to be honest. Yeah. With you. Yeah, the trend on in wheels on cars is for the offset to go farther and farther out, which makes the I wheels. Hate it. Just, I I'm fucking hate it. I'm happy with those wheels. I as long as I as long as I can eat in the car, I'm happy. As long as I can eat in the car, I'm happy with the wheels. <laughs> Eating and drinking while wearing my plepsi. I'm happy. I'm very happy. Yeah, those now, aren't look, the prettiest wheels. Do you understand that if you get the 300, you do get nicer wheels? Yeah. Those are 18 inch wheels. Yeah, super chats or what? And yeah, let me keep up the super chats. Tan. Oh, shit, yes. Okay, let's have a look at that door. Just one minute. I'm going to freeze it. Mm. Now, do you think you could get in there, Tan? Look at that space. How do you get in there? It's the I first can eat a chicken in that had. car. Archie, I can eat a chicken in that front seat. Tanzeal, $5. AC3, what do you think about these kids putting crackle tunes on their BMW? BMWs making their cars far worse than Archie after beans. Well, there was no beans in that salad last night, Dan. <laughs> you know what I mean? There was no beans in there. Is that the trend in Australia? Like they do that here you know, where everybody's like crackle and popping. You know what, Dan? Can I tell you something if you don't tell anyone? Sure. You know, my Beamer, you put it into sports mode, yeah. it crackles and pops, it's fake. You know what? When I had the M4, they did the. You ever heard yeah, about so, the so is the X5, guys. Yeah, X5 it, in the M4. It didn't. It didn't crackle on the original one. It did it on the competition. But did you do you remember when they used to filter the engine noise into the cabin? Like it was like fake. Yeah, yeah. No, that, that was really messed up. I think they do that on Archie's car. Do they? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, Tan. Do you need a drink in your cars, Tan? Of course. No, you unfortunately. Drink. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Tan, you'd yes. eat food in your car? Of course, why not? Because, because of course, Tan, yeah. this is great. Tan, you may have a spill. So, you get a ceramic coat inside. So, what? Fine, Who cares? Leather me... seats, they just rub straight off. Hello, Sovron. How are you? Archie, oh, oh, there's nothing worse than a bad night Sovron, out. Sovron, our lord. You know what, so It cost me $140, $144. The wife wasn't in the mood when we came back, right? Because it took yep. so fucking long to be served. I'm in the foulest of moods today. Is that okay with you? Damn straight. That's that's we're, we'll, we're going to get the best of Archie today. I like it when you're on the edge, boyo. I like it on the edge of the when you're on the edge. Lick her up, Archie. Lick her up, Archie. Lick her up. Drink some liquor. Is it from wheel drive? Archie, is it front wheel drive? No, no, it's no. rear wheel drive. No. no. Not so drive. bad, then. How can, how, can, how can a big boy like bloody plastic? I, I just oh, researched the new BMWs, though. The, new, the brand new BMWs, the lower models, are front wheel drive, which is quite disappointing. Um, Because they've, they've always been rear wheel drive. And, uh, is that this is a Tenzilla. complete departure. We got more money flowing in, boys. I hope we do. Have a great Ten show, Seal. guys. Hey, have a great show. See you, see you later, Seal. my friend. Sovron. See you, buddy. Ten, thank you, man. Sovron, five. That's uh, Tanzi or five dollars. Sovron, why the fuck is Archie buying these German stinkers and not getting a proper Aussie Australian made Australian muscle car like a? Because we don't make them here anymore. Don't make you, them anymore. General Motors ripped off our government, took all the taxpayer concessions and fucked off to the Caymans. Home. They, they fucked off, took their bat and ball and went home after and we'd already paid. Money. They took the government. Yeah. Now, seriously, Mike, do you see that this sucks. door is, is about six inches too s small or not? Yeah. No, if I went and took a picture of my car, the, the, the door oh, jam. Oh, your door was like a fucking, you could land an aircraft. In between. Yeah, no, you could fly, my door jam you could goes fly well your past. In between the doors, okay? I know yeah. the doors you've got. You've got fucking super long. Now, let me just show you this here. Look at this, guys. Look. Oh, I just want to show you this. Door. They have the two-door model there. But even, even the four-door models have long front doors. 
Look at this. I just want to show this to you. What the fuck is this? What's this script now? You you notice the mock carbon fiber? What do you think of mock carbon fiber with with twenty coats of fucking estopol on it, Sovron? Twenty coats of estopol. So it's like a fake carbon fiber with with, with thirty layers of glad wrap around around it. Well, you've got to you've got to get up to the it's disgusting. Do you like my Aussie description, Sav? Do you yeah, like my Aussie description? You've got to get up to the you got to get up to the AMG GT before it has real carbon fiber. Same yeah. as a same as a fake plastic trim. Yeah. Plastic like two the, one dollar. The BMW M3 has a, a carbon what fiber. What the fuck roof. is this iPad? Now you know what? I, so we went for a test drive. Okay, we went for a test drive. The air yeah. conditioning controls they're on this ipad why hasn't the ipad been integrated into this console why is it it left looks as like a 32 inch lg monitor just been slapped I, in there as an afterthought I, yeah it's like they laid them down big there and stuck them so in with big. bubble gum. big fucking deal because your air conditioning controls are on the bottom bit of the monitor okay why didn't you just have switches or buttons yeah you tell well, me it's, 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 it's just too home. easy to smash when you're pissed off with it so it, that, should be, and it should be an extended glass. If you have an electronic issue, man, god damn. You know. So do you understand what I'm saying? This is like a video game. This is like a, a video uh, game in the 90s. You know, video exactly. games. Exactly. You sit at either side you with it. You time put zone. You had a time zone in the, in the city. Remember time zone in the city? You go and play video games. It's like a simulator. <laughs> uh, Read the next super chat because I sent it to your WhatsApp. Tanzil, AC3 sent you the interior of the Horicon on your WhatsApp. Have a look. I will. Let me have a look at this here. Because you're talking Tanzil. about the interior being difficult to get in and out of. On supercars, they're not exactly the uh, most spacious and easy to get not, out. Not always. Some of them are. Actually, Tan, I like that Alcantara. I like the, the oh, yeah. that's Alcantara, is it or not? Yeah, it's Alcantara. It's a it's the sweet many... seat, so it's the carbon fiber it's and then fake, Alcantara. isn't it? Alcantara is fake, isn't yeah. it? Fake leather. How, how many? It's, it's, how many an, it's an amalgam of, of like rubber and bomb. leather suede mixed together, Look made at into this, a man. Look fabric. At this. Look at what the fuck did this thing? Go? Okay, how many go. names can they come up for vinyl? <laughs> You know, I had a fight with He goes, it's not vinyl, it's Artico. I said, what do you think Artico stands for? Artificial cow. Uh, yeah. uh, you got a point. That's what he said. Well, you and, take- I, and Alcantara wrapped Porsche steering wheel hey, cost hey, you an extra thousand hey. bucks. You know what, Sal? Can we bring that character with the teeth to the dealer? <laughs> <laughs> Can we stop? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Danny, Danny Boy was such a good sport. Taking that. <laughs> He's a good bloke. He's all right. That was a good. Seriously, fight. you know what? I actually like this. This looks. I like this much more than that stupid fucking Mercedes. Did you take this picture? Is that off the internet? Because that's the left hook. No, no, that's that's mine. It's my car. No, they left hook in oh. Canada. Yeah, it's my car. What kind of car is this? Hurricane Sorry. Lamborghini. Oh yeah, see that. Hey, that that's got pedal. some room there. You're missing that's a pedal, some... Tan. Where, where's the manual stick? They don't. They haven't made a manual <laughs> since the uh, Murcielago and Gallardo. No, do the pedals move back and forth in the seat stay stationary? So the seat is stationary. Uh, like it's not electric. It doesn't go up and down. It goes back and forth, and then you can tilt it. Oh, okay. Some of the newer cars, the seat stays stationary, and the pedals actually move forward and back for longer leg length um, no, instead no. of Let the me seat. Let me say moving. this to you. Yeah, that's racing spec, Mike. Uh, some of the new supercars, that's this is how they do it instead of uh, you know, the the, the seating position and yeah. steering wheel position is kind of set, and then they the pedals uh move to and back and forth. Uh, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna play this here for you guys. I want you to but, see, yeah. yeah. That's the that's door's like, so small. Look at and everything looks like an add on, it's not integrated. Economy really. car. You know yeah, who and there's, there's oh, two I'm, I'm sitting down, right? Sorry. You know who I'm oh, There is the buttons there. See those? That's the two on-off buttons there. So it might be a jumbo screen, but you lose the bottom three inches for bloody normal controls. Nothing great about that. 
look, look at this. You just and, get and I hate pissed it. off I with it. it. You get pissed off with it when it crashes. When it crashes, you get pissed off with it and just rip it off the dash. It's not even integrated it's into not... the dash. What with, why do they do that? Look, the look thing at that, this. The thing they've forgotten is in a car, you need something with a tactile response because you can't take your eyes off the road for more than a second and you need to know that whatever button yeah. you push is... This is not paper. good. Tanzeal, $5. Got to drop. Have a good watch show later on. Tanzeal, we love you, Zeal. The Zeal is in the house. I got to tell you guys, this is, I honestly was so disappointed. <clears throat> and, and look at those air vents there. They're just plastic painted gray. It's supposed to look like aluminum. That doesn't look like fucking matte aluminum. You know, it looks like plastic. Dirt. Plastic. Look at this. It, it's, it's nothing. <clears throat> it. Yeah. But it is right. the economy sedan. Yeah, I it's think it's a hundred fucking thousand dollars. Is that economy sub? Well, it's great economy for the state. The A class like is the economy yeah. sedan. Yeah, this is not an economy, this is the executive saloon. They may have joined forces. The, the A class is the economy. Look at this. This is not the economy. It's the executive. This the, exactly. This is executive size sedan. Okay. It doesn't, the doors too. It's only for cool little trendy people. What about fat bastards? Fat bastards with eating Chinese disorders. People. Because, look at this. The look back door is bigger than the front door. I know. That's because who gives a fuck about the back passenger? Jesus, you couldn't swing a cat back there. <laughs> Can you see why I'm disappointed well, it, so in, or not? In China, in China, Audi, Archie, Archie, in China, they sell Audis with longer back doors for um, in the 3 Series, in the um, A3 and A6. In the BMW 3 Series specialist, in India. Specialist for Chinese market. Called the limousine. they got a limousine version, which is a couple inches longer. The limousine. Called the three series limousine. Nice. Yeah. It's got it's got stupid, stupid, it's got buttons to do the seat. I, mean, I don't even put the seats down. Okay, at oh, least it's got a release. Oh. It may have, does it have a, a spare tire underneath? No, there? run flats. Of course, they're all, the Germans oh, have all gone run flat. Yeah. In, a, in, in Australia, you can't have run flats because you're 200 kilometers between towns. And you and everyone's going past you on the road doing 120 kilometers an hour, and you're sitting there doing 25. Flop, 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 yeah, because to your differential, it's like the car's going around a hard left-hand turn. That's why they say never go over 40 miles an hour um, when you put that little donut, you know, spare okay, tire on. The, the yeah, but at least wheel. you can get you can get home with the donut on. The worst thing yeah, it was but, a but you know, you better <laughs> keep it below 45 if you value no, your I differential. Never, 20 years ago. When you actually had a spare and you could change it, Look at that. what did you do? You couldn't yeah, put the spare anywhere. You had to keep your wife out and put the spare in a bag in the passenger seat and drive it home. And your missus had to walk home by right? herself. <laughs> yep. The because only the little donut would fit in the car, and you'd have to piss well, the missus off and put your, honestly, put your, put your five thousand dollar rim in the passenger seat. In a, in a, in a if, you, if you get a flat. In your tire, the fix a flat can't fix. You, uh, you, you need to call a tow truck, anyways. Okay, because uh, that means that a giant bolt has gone through your tire or through your rim and your tire, and it's nothing a fix a flat's going to fix. You're going to need either a, a replacement wheel or uh, a you know a uh, um, a spare tire, and and since that's not included, and the fix a flat won't fix it. You just call car side assistance, which Archie has as part of his uh, um, uh, payment plan. So well, that might be all right. In, that might be all right in California, Mike, but not in Australia, where you're two, three hundred kilometers between towns. Yeah, right? I mean, and you might have to wait a little bit longer. But... With an old rusty bloody, with an old rusty F100 with a towing hook on the back, hook mm -hmm. it underneath, pull your front bumper bar off, and and drag the thing while the transmission's still in gear, and blow up the box by the time you get home. 
man, you got to witness Australia. You, you guys are too spoiled over there. Yeah, no, I, I, I'm learning. There's, there's huge differences. Um, you know, I mean, you guys got I a hate lot of different car. cars. Stop run. Um, I hate it. Did they have the coupe on display? They haven't the launched the new coupe. It's only the sedan. Oh, only the sedan. Well, that's, that's half. The other thing I hate half. about new cars is everything's going to four doors, and it's like, fuck four doors. I hate it. Look at that. Did you end? Up, did you end? Oh, did you end up sitting in the car then, or not? I drove it. What? What? What were the seats like? Seats were okay. Comfortable or as nice as your dad's uh, one. Archie, at at your age, at at your age, you've passed that car, right? Yeah. It's either it's either a young person's car or an older person's car. You're in between, right? Get the car. Get the car you got, man. You got the right car. I'm just so disappointed. Why? Why? You got the car you want. What's wrong with it? I mean, you got got the car you want. Why are you disappointed? So disappointed in Mercedes. I mean, what are you? You already own that car. I love Mercedes Benz. Yeah, but I mean, I mean, they're they're over there. You know, you're you're a BMW man now, so. Um, I wanted to make buyer's remorse Mercedes videos Jones. for a week. I wanted to make three weeks of buyer's remorse. I bought the wrong car. You did yeah, but buy Archie, the right you car. Can't well, you can that, do anyway. Have you tried to sit in an A? I physically can't right? even sit in an A. I cannot physi- I physically cannot sit in an A class. I can't get in. You know what, so They've also moved They've also to an agency moved model moved in Australia for Mercedes Benz. You know that? You know that? Yep. I hate that. I hate that. Everyone, every, all of the dealerships got if paid out. Want, and now everything's want. everything's owned by the company now. Yeah. Yeah. I thought they get a commission for each car. They get it. Hey, who's got the Echo one? Who's got that Echo one? Who the fuck has got that? Is that Sov? Hello, Sov. It's you, Sov. I'll um, I'll chime out then, man. Oh, you're okay now. You're okay now. You're okay now. Oh, fuck. Except when you're talking. Except when you're talking. Talk, 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 talk. Here we go. We got, we got Tommy. Oh, Tommy, I'm in a bad mood today. Why, man? Why? I took the the wife out to a restaurant last night, right? Yeah. The service was so slow. They brought another bottle of sparkling water because I, the only reason I drank the first bottle was because the service was so fucking slow. I didn't realize they slugged me $7 for it. Uh. <laughs> then they recommended a salad. All it was, it wasn't a salad. It was just fucking lettuce leaf. How is that a fucking salad? I wanted oil. I wanted mushroom, a bit of capsicum, a bit of onion. No, just fucking leaf. Yeah. At least you know not and to then, go there. And then... That restaurant is notorious. You tell them it's your birthday. They sing happy birthday. They bring out a cupcake. They forgot for my wife. Oh my so I've, God. Just, I've just written them an, uh, an email and told them what, they fu- what I fucking thought of their service last night. Yeah. No, you should. That's okay. ridiculous. I said to them, re- hello, really it's disappointed. Why bring, bring, Cheap why, bring, why, bring, why bring a second bottle of sparkling water without first water asking? Without you charged me $7 seven for a second, second bottle. The only reason I drank the first was because your service was so fucking slow. Slow. Seven. Just mute Sov for a moment there. (laughs) You recommended the salad. That was not salad. That was merely lettuce. No olive oil, no capsicum, no mushroom. So damn boring and expensive for lousy lettuce. Number three, it was my wife's birthday and nobody sang happy birthday. I have endured the singing for every other person, but we miss out. I won't be coming back. Really upset and let down. Please ring to discuss and I'll gladly explain in detail. I'm in a foul fucking mood today. I can tell you that there, Tommy. Yeah. You know, I was in a great mood with Tommy. I got mats, mats for the Beamer, mats for the (laughs) Beamer. And now I'm in a foulest of moods. We got to do something about that, man. And Tommy, I went to see the C class. I hate it. I hate it. 
Yeah, I saw the video. Oh. Yes. Gladly, gladly accept a refund, and uh, and then you might not go on TripAdvisor. But it has to be in the next few days, otherwise uh, no go. I don't want to threaten them just yet, but I'm just so I'm angry at the moment. I'm so, and then I get home with the wife, and she's not in the mood. Fuck me, Dad. I spent 144 fucking dollars, and they're not in the mood. What do you think I'm supposed to say, That's Tommy? No good. Uh, I think you should definitely be outraged. Definitely send the email, man. That's ridiculous. Not even the cupcake. I'm trying to be much cooler now. I don't know if you know this, guys. I've had a few stress problems, right? So I bought these fake succulents. See these succulents? These are succulents. Fake. They're plastic, okay? Oh, yeah? I got plastic succulents to try and cool me down a bit. I'm getting a bit worked up, okay? Yeah, it's not helping. I went to Mercedes-Benz. The car sucks. The car sucks. I look at this. This mock carbon fiber. The seats, I don't even really like it. I didn't even really. Look at this, all this shit. What the fuck is this iPad in the middle of the car for? I hate the Did vertical. I yeah, I don't like it. I, I, I really, at least this, this is the 300. At least it had real leather. Yeah, that's true. I got to be totally honest, Tommy. I don't know what the fuck these boys were thinking. I mean, hey, it's great you didn't buy that car, right? Yeah. I'm, I'm just saying. Red car, I, I, red I love car. Mercedes. I love, I'm a, I'm a warrior for the brand. Do you understand? Yeah, but, but you didn't buy one. Yeah, but I'm a warrior. I always love Benzes. Do you understand? I love my Benzes. Yeah, well, obviously, they've gone downhill, so. That's probably that but, model, too. Arch, what, Arch how much is entry level? Uh, it's fucking it. Sorry, how, how much, much is the entry level? Uh, what? <laughs> what the fuck? You got uh, the mumbling uh, at Audi Quattro. Ah, oh, fuck Audi. I'm not buying a Vag. Fuck Vag. Volkswagen <laughs> Audi Group can fuck himself. Dieselgate, you can get fucked. You know that they're lying sons of bitches. You know that <laughs> they're lying yeah. sons of bitches. 100%. I had a I had a friend with a Jetta that just had like nightmarish problems. Like you're driving along on the freeway and it just the lights go dead, your power steering goes dead. Oh, that, that uh, was the, a you lose all problem, engine Mike. power Mike, and you're lucky if you even get problem. off the road alive. Mike, Mike, that's a transmission problem. Mike? I don't know what it was, but he's no, no, lucky to get I off the road alive. I know all about that alive, problem, Mike. I know all about that. That's the that's that fucking DSG gearbox they use. Wow. I know all about that. Don't worry about that. Yeah. I'm just so fucking disappointed, you know? Absolutely. And I'm just I'm just telling you guys, I I feel I feel let down, okay? So we went out for a drive in it, all this tech, super tech, and I can't find the switches to turn the aircon down because it's on this fucking iPad. It's all on the iPad there. Look, that's where the, the buttons are. That's it, the iPad. Yep. That's all taking your eyes off the road to where you're going to crash your car trying to change your fucking air conditioning setting. Yeah, just like Tesla, all on the iPad. Well, you know, Mercedes and Tesla are in bed together, don't you? Plus, they, they look like <laughs> they just bubble gummed an iPad onto the fucking dashboard. I know. Why isn't it integrated? That vertical. It looks horrible. Why do that? And, and the other one, the driver's dash, I, I, I hate that. You know, Mike, I prefer normal instruments. You know that, Mike? Oh, uh, me too. Absolutely. I they, call, I they, they call them steam gauges, the old style steam gauges, like that just have a <laughs> pin and a, and a needle. You know, they used to be liquid filled and they called them steam gauges on an aircraft. But yeah, you know, good old regular. Knobs, you know, pins and needles that turn and get, give you a point of number. So um, my dad's got the C two hundred Mercedes, right? Guess what? I had a, I had, I got angry at him as well last night. <laughs> what happened? Okay, so he doesn't fucking talk to me, Dad. Talk to me. I know a bit about cars. Okay. Yeah. When we had the grey Mercedes, we went to a Mercedes, an independent Mercedes service guy, Mercedes Center. Okay, it was independent. You understand independent or not? Independent. Like it wasn't a dealer franchise. Yeah, it yeah, was okay, a sure. Specialized sure, sure. Mercedes repair place, but it wasn't a dealer. Okay. Yeah, sure. 
So his prices are about half what the dealer charges. Yeah, that makes sense. My dad had $3,300 the last service. I said, what the fuck are you doing, Dad? Jesus Christ. And it's because they did the brakes and the rotors. I said, yeah, of course that's expensive. You don't get it done through the dealer. Absolutely. Even with my service pack, my service pack doesn't include brakes and rotors. Guess what? I'll get it done by an indie. Do you understand or not? <laughs> an indie. <laughs> No, that's, that's surprising. No, no, that's what you do, man. You get it done for an indie, don't you, or not? I, absolutely. Yeah, I never do. Maybe it's, that's a least thing. As soon as in, America, in America, the brakes, uh, if they fall, if they happen to die before the, the uh, four year, 40,000 miles is up, they, they up and replace the brakes as well. Not tires, but yeah. um, I had my brakes up and replaced under warranty. Um, because my car still fell under warranty as a second owner. Um, yeah, you were saying that the other day. And uh, look at this plastic, look how look how shiny this plastic shit is. We're in the middle of the sun. It's so reflective. It's like a fucking mirror in your face. It's gonna blind you. Yeah. yeah. That's why you need that uh, reflector thing to keep your your dash from look at this. Look at, look at, you can see a this thousand degrees. In this thing. Look Too at much that. Gloss. Piano black. Kind of dash, no, no this piano is mock of the carbon car fiber. Too. Mock carbon fiber with 20 gallons of Estopol on top of it. Oh, wow. It's just shit. You can already see the dust on the iPad. Look how much dust and shit and grime is on the iPad there. Look at that shit. Yeah. It's horrible. Yeah. And you know what? On a hot day, that iPad screen will cease to function and will <laughs> turn black. And won't function until it's cooled off by your air conditioning. You think it'll like overheat, that? Mike? Yeah, on a hundred degree day. Because it first. Yeah. Um, and we I, get hundred degree bet. days, Mike. We get hundred degrees sometimes. Well, I've left my phone in my car. But the problem is, Mike, if it gets that it hot, out. you know what, Mike? If it gets that hot, you won't be able to use the air conditioning because the <laughs> vents are all controlled by the fucking iPad. That's what I'm saying. So you won't be able like, to engage the air conditioning anyhow. I have to let it my, cool my down itself. Phones, I've left my cell phone in my car on a hot day, and it's the screen's been like completely disabled until the phone cooled back off. And wow. uh, and I'm afraid that these cars on a hundred degree day, unless you cover your windshield with a wind you know protector, um, that 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 screen's going to get baked to 160 degrees, and the screen, the LED, you know whatever the 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 new fucking technology is gonna the screen's just not gonna function. It's gonna come but it's gonna be all pixelated and black not, and parts of it'll work and parts Mike, won't. Can you see why I'm angry or not? Can you see why I'm angry or not? Yeah. We can, but we don't want you to be angry. I'm disappointed. And by the way, do you like the leather trim there? Look at that, the faux. That's supposed to be it's it's just vinyl. It may they make it look like faux leather. Look at that. <laughs> With the stitching. Now, Archie, I have to say, 10 years ago, I had my first BMW had their pleather, their fake leather I hate um, pleather. seats. You know um, but you know what? That, uh, that fake leather was as nice as real leather. Um, and huh? it, it didn't show any wear and tear, and it held up and looked as nice. And you, couldn't, you had to look hard to tell that it wasn't real leather. And it held up better than leather. My real leather seats on my 10-year-old car are showing wear where I get in and out every day. You know, the, the piping is wearing out around the, the seams, and it's kind of discolored, you know, because every, every time you get in and out, you rub really hard on that, that lumbar side. Um, and leather, leather definitely, you know, will, you know, I mean, it, it's durable, but... Um, you know, it's not impervious, and the plastic, the, the the pleather seats that I had on my first BMW looked as new as the day I bought the car when I when I uh, turned it back in, um, and uh, traded it up for a different car. Um, and yeah, but that was ten years ago. Now today, I have I have no idea. Hmm. Yeah, but yeah, I'm just the last smell. Right? It's the smell of the real leather that you need, also. Yeah, that's to get the full experience. Well, they're working on faking that, you know. 
they can well, fake that. They you know that. what I mean? I think, I think they add that, like your 10,000 mile car that you just bought probably had that and put in it. Wow. Um, cause, uh, my, my car with 20,000 miles when I bought it had that new car smell. And I'm like, how can this have a new car smell when, you know, it's been broken in and left out. What did the they sun? say? Oh, oh, no. I didn't even ask. It just smelled like new, so I was fine with it. You, no, you still get it um, up to 20,000 miles. No, no, you still get that up to 20,000 miles. I know cars a couple of years old that still smell new. It depends how yeah. many times someone's vomited in the back. <laughs> well, that and if whether or not it's to... garage kept. If it's garage yeah. kept, then they, they, will, they will retain their, their newness. But you can oh. get into a, an 80s SL and still smell the leather, can't you? Huh. Yeah. Yeah, I gotta be honest with yeah. you guys. It's um, M3 Carlino. They have new car spray. I don't know. Maybe I'm fragrance. just negative. You think I'm negative or not? Am I being negative or, or what do you think? Am I being no, negative? I think, or I think what? you should be positive and happy that you bought the right car. Yeah, that's a good point. I don't think you should be yeah. should, should be like focusing so oh, much way, on, Tommy, on how wife, shitty Mercedes the is. Loves I think the new be... rubber mats. She loves really? the rubber mats. Oh yeah. Great, no. yeah. She said, oh, those new really rubber nice. mats that fit so perfectly, man. They make and they're they they have edges on them, so you can literally spill a fairly large amount of liquid, and and they won't touch the carpet ever because the edges they have edges on them all the way up. An inch high. Oh, they got special. So exactly. you can spill a whole exactly. Pepsi. I, I was thinking about putting goldfish um, in the car. Oh, there's so much room there, Mike. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You keep koi fish. You, <laughs> you can grow koi, koi fish yeah. in your car. Um, <laughs> down in your footwell. Oh, oh. that's not barbecue. Oh, can you remember, can you remember um, if yes. sucker horn sucker horns jag smell? Can you remember the smell of the leather in that, or was it not noticed? Yeah, that before? was. A, can you remember back? That was that. 1989. It smelled like tobacco. Okay. Oh right, I see. I see. Yeah. yeah. It's an XJ40. Okay. XJ. His sucker horn's got an X. You know the XJ40. I used to love the XJ40s. That's the square headlight, the one single wiper blade model. Yeah. Equalizer. Yeah. Um, I got to be honest with you guys. Seriously, <sighs> Tommy. Yeah. How is your mother's? You got a you got a Kia coming, haven't you? It's, yeah, it's so we already have it. Yeah, the Hyundai. The Hyundai. How, How is that? Been, it's amazing, man. It, it was you know what? Yeah, I, I, the thing about I, I Hyundai, they were the laughing stock. They used to be you're, the laughing stock, right? You're right. Yeah, you know what? Right. They they're really giving the Japanese a run for the money. And, I agree. And, and I would say yeah. the Honda, the CRV, I'd prefer the Hyundai over the CRV because lost yeah. the yeah. plot. I don't know yeah. if you realize this. Honda has really lost the plot. I agree. Um, Hyundai's yeah. got some great cars there. I don't know if you really look at the Genesis. They've got the Genesis line. That's going to be incredible. I love Genesis. I love Genesis, man. My, my father's on three of their SUV. I forget what model they Santa call Fe. it. Santa Fe. He's on three different Santa Fe's, all of which went well over 200,000 miles with the worst care. <laughs> like, I mean, he drove, he'd never changed the oil until the oil oh, lights fuck. started coming on. And then he'd take it in and they'd change the oil and he'd drive it until the oil light would come on like 30, 40, oh, 50,000 miles. Why does he do that, man? Change. What the hell's wrong with you? Dad? And the, man, the car still ran 280,000 miles before he fucking got a new one. Actually, it was running fine until somebody wrecked into him in an intersection. Um, oh. Hyundai has their shit together. And it in fact, I like think that. the Genesis is designed by the same designer as Mercedes. You can see the, oh, the, the lineage. You can see the Sorry, genetics in the in the Hyundai Coupe or the Genesis Coupe. If yeah. you were to pull the Hyundai li stickers off the, off the front and back and put a, a new Mercedes and a Hyundai Genesis nose to nose, you you would you 
probably could not tell which is a Mercedes and which is a Hyundai. Yeah. Um, they really, I believe, are designed by the same designer. Um, I love Genesis. And can you bring them up? You know can what? you bring them up, Art? On top of that, they're powered by a 450, 500 horsepower V8. <laughs> And rear wheel drive and fucking monsters. This is the four door sedan. Okay. Not not the coupe. The, the coupes G7. Are little, coupes are little fucking pieces of junk. So did uh, you get a Santa Fe? What did you get? What did you yep, get? I got the Santa Fe, the top calligraphy trim. So that has the Napa leather. Nice. Yeah. Nice. It's, it's beautiful, man. It's got microfiber suede headliner. It's got Rear sunshade privacy, you know, uh, sunshades that you pull up. It's got thigh extension powered. It's amazing. Oh, it's yeah. like this. Is that what yours is? Yeah. Um, so so like what size BMW, engine is it? It's what a size 2. is the 5, engine? 2.5 liter turbo. Oh, nice. It's a four cylinder. It's a four cylinder? Yeah, four cylinder. Correct. Correct. Okay. That's all numbers, you need. If it's turbo, the number of cylinders doesn't matter, man. The, these they, are a they, they these are mid size, up. aren't they? They're mid size. This is not a small car. No, uh, no. I think Hyundai calls them compact, but it is a mid size measuring it. Yep. But they're they're larger in, along well, the in inside. The range the inside. Of, that looks uh, SUVs. nicer than the Mercedes I just sat in. That they looks got nicer than the Mercedes I just went. Yeah. Hyundai the SUVs, their tires are larger. Than Honda and Toyota SUVs, they they actually run larger diameter, larger wheel tires. Look at than, the inside; that looks so beautiful. Um, Look at that; that is fucking yeah, beautiful. They got their What's shit together, that? man. Oh, it's great. Yeah, I'm telling you. how much was that in America? Uh, it was forty three plus market adjustment, so around forty five, forty six, and then. What did she have it. before that? What did your mom have before this? A what did Toyota, your mom have before yeah, this? Toyota Venza, along with the best warranty in the industry. Correct. Like five what years or ten years and a hundred thousand miles. Nothing really, Paul. It was twenty twelve, right? So she had over two hundred thousand miles, and I think oh, it started slipping. It. Yeah, okay. this, the transmission slipped in second or something like that, or the gear slipped. I don't know. It was something weird. Mechanical what, problem. 200,000 so. miles? Oh, yeah. 209,000 miles. Well, there's no point. You don't want to put too much money into that sort of thing, do you? <laughs> Absolutely. It was, it was time to get a new car. Your, your mom and dad don't live together? No, they do. They do. Okay. Because your dad bought you the BMW. Yeah, no, they both live together. Yeah, we're, we're they, they don't family. help each other out. Why didn't your dad say to mom, "Hey, I'll buy you a nice car"? Oh, as well. he was going to. No, he was, but I wanted to do it just because, just to do something special, you know. Because usually it's the other way around; they do stuff for me. Oh, that's so sweet. That's so nice, man. <laughs> so, yeah. did you get what color inside? Did you get? So it's uh, they call it black, but it looks like. Did a you deep get the gray. rubber mats for them as well? <laughs> no, but we were probably going to get weather tech mats. Nice. Okay. Doesn't get yeah. better than them. Yeah. Unless mm -hmm. it's OEM from a nice, beautiful brand like BMW. Yeah, but even weather yeah. tech. They no, love weather tech. tech. <clears throat> they do. Weather nope. tech, uh, one step above that. I got to be honest with you, man. I fucking like this Santa Fe. This is a people. This is a really good vehicle. They garage it. I hope, don't they? Absolutely. Absolutely. And they service it? Uh, so they just got it. But if they were going to get serviced, I don't think they would go to the dealer. It would probably be the guy who they go to who's independent. What's wrong with the dealer? Oh, nothing. I mean, if it's – so this actually I, has – I thought they got five-year or seven-year yeah. warranty. So they have amazing warranty, but they also have three years of complimentary maintenance. Now, that's done. Yes. It. Yes, that's done. So it. they go for that, wouldn't they? It's Absolutely. free. Absolutely. 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 That's scheduled maintenance, right? That's like oil changes yeah. and things. Yeah. Well, that's the best thing. You, you want to keep a car going. Oh. Oil and filters, Mike. Absolutely. Yeah. That's the cheapest insurance you can get oh. is oil and filter. Yeah. Yeah. As long as the intervals oh, are, are, are reasonable. Is that Sorry? I think the directors of design, uh, the new new directors of design at Hyundai, uh, formerly from Audi. I think I think that's right. Yeah, I think I... you might be right there. What happens yeah. is, you know, what happens. I don't know if you know this. What happens with Hyundai and the Koreans, like Kia? Yeah. So you know all the tooling. This is how it happened. They buy the tooling 
from the previous Mazda or Toyota lines because yep. that tooling mm. is millions of dollars. So I don't know if you noticed this. If you go back 20 years ago when you saw Hyundai's or Kia's, they looked a bit dated. And the reason Absolutely. was they had bought the tooling. Does that make sense? Do you, do you yeah. understand what I mean? Yeah, yeah. The pr past tooling of another brand. Correct. Well, the, there used to be a, an old uh, in That's high school. There was now, a, a little car, uh, economy car called the Dodge Horizon. Yeah, it was a little little box car. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. and the Volkswagen Scirocco, you know, their little hot hot high performance car. Yeah, yeah. Um, well, um, Dodge, uh, Volkswagen bought the the uh, the rights of the engine from Dodge and built their engines you could literally pull the engine out of a dodge horizon and it would bolt into a volkswagen scirocco and Did vice you know versa they um, also the floor pan from the mercedes sorry the floor pan from the chrysler 300c you know the 300c's yeah mm -hmm. that's a previous model e-class yes oh, wow yes yes and that and that weird the looking headlight the circle that weird headlight looking one. uh um, Dodge uh, that has that they th that weird. You're back talking end, about the convertible, um, the Cabriolet. That's actually that uses the Mercedes SLK. It's basically a Mercedes car. Is wow. the entire car is Mercedes? No, um, it's not a Mercedes because it's fucking ugly. Okay. Well, no, <laughs> I mean it's ugly, but the interior, the 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 doorknobs, the the yeah, the, it's the interior knobs, exactly. the dashboard, all that shit's Mercedes. Wow. I gotta tell you I'm seriously. Going, I'm going to anyway because the Archie Luxury live streams on in two minutes. Yeah, I gotta shoot off too, guys. Thank you so yeah. much. What's James? Right? What's your, <laughs> your first name? Right? Uh, just Jay. Jay's fine. Jay. Thank you. Jay. 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 Thanks, Jay. Yeah, I nice gotta tell you guys you. seriously. Uh, Snake, Snake. Yeah, I got a lot of respect me, for Arch. Hyundai. Yeah, no worries. Come anytime. Come again. Snake, I got to tell you, Hyundai, I almost think you're paying a Toyota tax now. Toyota's got this reputation. Yeah. I don't no, think... they're, they're overblown. And you know that new Toyota? You know they got that turbo. The, they're, they're often in yellow. You know that little baby SUV? It's very cute. They're using a very small, and it's turbocharged engine. The rest the company no, to really look at Rav. is it's smaller than the Rev. The, oh. the company to really look at is Mazda. They've got a, a new oh, revolutionary no, Mazda, engine. Mazda has taken over from where Hi Honda was the BMW of Asia. Yeah. That is now. But I'd still take a Hyundai over a Mazda. I, I love oh. Mazda's exterior styling, but inside they don't even have touch screens yet. And I know some people hate touch Who screens. Who cares? Like, their tech is, is old, it, man. Yeah, I'd rather have old tech, man. You don't, you don't, and their Stinger, uh, the, the Kia, the the Kia Stinger. Yeah. Have you seen Man, this? Oh, the Stinger. You know, the ride. Stinger is a G70. You get that, a Genesis, a Genesis. They do it as a Genesis as well. Yeah. Look at this. Do you see this here? Do you have this in America? This is the baby. No, we don't. I don't I'm not sure if we have CHR. that in America. But I saw a Stinger the other day, and it was. Uh, I looked at it and said, that's a four-door I would actually fucking rock. Yeah. Um, that's a twin-turbo V6. That fucking thing, that'll yeah. eat. Mo that's just the police in my country use them. Okay, actually, yeah. I think that no, it's not a like, it's not a baby. Uh, yeah. the, the no CHR, joke anymore. that's smaller than the Rav Four. I actually like the Rav Four, but in many cases now you're paying a Toyota tax because they've got this. In, in America, the Rav Four is this bare bones little fucking front wheel drive, <laughs> sometimes four wheel drive. Uh, semi SUV. Put a comment here. Hyundai has an amazing appearance, but the veneer of quality falls off everything after 10 years, yep. and Mercedes doesn't. Fuck Maybe me, so. dead. Do you think show, me a car that doesn't, show me a car that doesn't that's not been garaged? Exactly, you did say everything. Yeah, you know, if it's not been garaged, man, give it 10 years in the sun, sun beats anything down. Yeah, absolutely. Archie, I might be a little late for, for your hey, regular I gotta go, show. Guys. See you um, over see Guys, I'll I'm on the over Archie there. Luxury live stream channel. That's my other channel. Jump over there. See yeah. you later, guys. It might be a little late, but 